field and all the, the, the conditioning would that take place at the ground. Um, a lot of that stuff's just the top up stuff, the conditioning sense, getting them aerobically fit or dealing with the speed and intensity of, of the game. So we try and prepare them for the games that are coming and also for the future. So it's not just about that moment, you're looking towards making them better. The time that we practice is around like 5, 4, 35. By the time the temperature is still high over here in Abu Dhabi. So we make sure we keep the warm up very short and quick and quick burst. At the same time, you know, we make sure that they do their individual drills. Like they all, they have their routine. They're all like, you know, pros, so they know their routine. They have their routine. It's a fine line between making sure that you get them up, but also that you don't risk the game performance. So it's a really fine line and that's where we have to manage them each individually and you speak to them individually again and make sure that they get what they need and, and not just a group mentality. Like, you know, we had a quarantine time, right? Those times, like, they were not doing much. So what we had to do was, uh, CD and I, uh, so we made sure that all of them are participating in the training sessions. So we had the Zoom call sessions where all of them participated. We made sure everyone trained really hard. You're dealing with all those components that come with the stresses on the system from the environment and um, you have to take that into consideration. And my job is just to try and manage them as much as possible. And when they play in the game, I'm around the boundary with the 12th men, making sure that they get serviced and get as much hydration they need and also trying to cool them down, their core temperature down as much as possible. We make sure that they don't overtrain. at the same time they're ready for a training camp because training camp is full throttle. So there's, there's a lot of components that come into play when you're dealing with athletes in cricket and we're just going to keep, keep make sure that we look after them. We make sure that they maintain their strength, maintain their conditioning, they should definitely move well, feel light and that's a very important goal and hydrate well especially during this weather.